you know, when it comes to healing and regeneration, one particular organ stands out as the (laughs) all-star. It's the liver. Capable of regenerating up to 70% of its tissue, the liver continues to defy what we think of or what we think we know about aging. Did you know that even after surgery, your liver can grow back to full size? And get this, no matter your age. Today, we'll dive into the liver's regenerative abilities and explore how lifestyle factors like exercise and diet play a key role in boosting liver health. And we'll show you that your body's healing potential doesn't fade as you get older. All this and more today on the Personal Edge Fitness Podcast. Welcome to the Personal Edge Fitness Podcast with Garrett Williamson. Health, wellness, exercise, nutrition, and a whole lot more. Got questions? Call us and leave a message at 251-278-EDGE or message us at Personal Edge Fitness on Facebook and Instagram at Team PE on Twitter or PersonalEdgeFitness.com. Good day and welcome to the Personal Edge Fitness Podcast where we are dispelling the myths of health, fitness, and wellness. I'm your host, Garrett Williamson, president of Personal Edge Fitness. Today we're exploring one of the most incredible organs in the human body, the liver. Known for its ability to regenerate up to 70% of its tissue, the liver's regenerative power is a perfect example of how the body heals itself at any age. If you have any questions about today's episode, or if you'd like to learn more, reach out to us at area code 251-278-3343. That's also 251-278-EDGE. You can email me at Garrett at personaledgefitness.com or visit personaledgefitness.com. You can also connect with us on Twitter or X at Team PE or Facebook at Personal Edge Fitness. Let's jump into the liver's remarkable (laughs) ability to repair itself, just like I've said many times about the human body. Let's start with the basics. The liver, one of the largest organs in your body, plays a critical role in digestion, metabolism, and detoxification, something that we regularly know it for. But what really makes the liver special is its ability to regenerate. Unlike other organs that may have limited repair capacity, the liver can regrow up to 70% of its tissue if damaged. It's such a powerful organ that even if part of it is removed surgically, the remaining tissue can grow back to full size within months. Now, as always, I've got plenty of science to back this up. In fact, a study from the University of Edinburgh looked at over 800 patients ranging from 30 to 80 years old who had undergone liver surgery. The results showed no significant difference in the liver's ability to regenerate between older and younger patients. Now, this is key because it tells us that, as always, as I've been telling you for years, age doesn't limit the liver's regenerative capacity. Your liver continues to function as a healing powerhouse, no matter how old you are. While the liver's regenerative abilities are quite impressive on their own, they can be further enhanced. You can change this by certain lifestyle factors, especially diet and physical activity, or exercise. All right, a little more science. For example, a study published in the journal Heptology found that regular physical activity not only supports overall liver health, but also helps the liver manage fat and inflammation more efficiently. Now, these two factors, fat accumulation and inflammation, had a podcast on that recently, are major contributors to liver disease. So regular exercise is a powerful tool in protecting your liver's regenerative capabilities. And remember, when it comes to liver disease, one of the main causes of that happens to be obesity, which is the number one cure for obesity, diet and exercise. Think of exercise as fuel for the liver's recovery process. When you move, you're not only keeping your muscles and heart healthy, but you're also helping your liver stay in top shape so it can continue to do its job, filtering toxins, managing blood sugar, and as always, repairing itself. Yet another example of how the body, unlike any machine, improves with the right care and attention. Now let's switch from exercise. Let's move on to diet. What you eat has a profound impact on your liver's health and its ability to regenerate. 
One particularly important nutrient for liver health is something you've heard of, I'm sure, which is antioxidants. These help protect the liver from oxidative stress. Foods like leafy greens, berries, and fatty fish are rich in these nutrients and play a key role in supporting the liver's regenerative functions. Take, for example, a study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition, which showed that diets rich in antioxidants and healthy fats, ones that are similar to like the Mediterranean diet, though I don't always advocate that one for everything. But in the Mediterranean diet, you have a lot of leafy greens and fruits and vegetables, and these can improve liver function and promote regeneration. This is because those nutrients help reduce inflammation and support the liver's ability to break down fats and remove toxins. So by simply eating a diet full of nutrient-dense foods, you're giving your liver the resources it needs to heal and function optimally and, of course, regenerate. And here's an interesting connection. A study published in Gastroenterology found that coffee, (laughs) yeah, coffee can have a protective effect on the liver. Drinking two to three cups of coffee per day has been associated with a lower risk of liver disease and improved liver function. It's just one more way that lifestyle factors can influence the health and regenerative capacity of this incredible organ. Now let's talk a little bit more about liver's regenerative power, how it's so unique. We've often compared the human body to a machine. I've done that many times, but there's, there's one major difference. Machines break down with use. While the body has the ability to repair itself, often growing stronger in the process, the liver is a perfect example of this. Think about your car engine. Once a part is damaged or worn out, it needs to be replaced. It's got to go to the mechanic. There's no natural regeneration happening under the hood. But your liver doesn't work that way. When a portion of the liver is damaged or even surgically removed, it doesn't just stop working. It actually, it's its own repair team. It actually regenerates growing new cells and tissue to replace what is lost. This regenerative ability is what makes not only the liver, but the entire human body so unique. I've told you it's the most amazing machine on the planet. It doesn't just withstand damage. It actively repairs and recovers. And the best part, this ability doesn't diminish. It doesn't change with age. It continues. Just like those 800 participants in that Edinburgh study, it doesn't change whatsoever, not with time passing on a calendar. So your ability to affect this, your ability to improve this, doesn't change over time. Just to quickly recap, liver is an amazing function, and it can regenerate up to 70%, 70% of itself. And this can be affected. We talk about the fact that this seems to degenerate over time. It seems to because we are acting on it. We are actually causing the damage. But we can turn around and influence the repair, which it's naturally programmed to do through diet and exercise. If you have any more questions about this particular podcast or any others or any questions about dispelling the myths of health, fitness, and wellness, please reach out to me. Call me at area code 251-278. 3343. That's 251 278 Edge. You can also reach me at Garrett, G A R R E T T, at personaledgefitness.com. Personaledgefitness.com is also our website. Reach out to us on X or Twitter at Team PE. You can also contact us through Facebook. The liver, an incredible organ, an important organ. So many different functions, like everything else in the human body. Those same processes work throughout the body, which can keep you young. And getting this information to you, understanding that we should not fear time passing on a calendar or automatically assume that that means degeneration. It's just one more way we help you reach your level of wellness. Thank you so much for joining me today. I'll see you next time. Thanks for listening to the Personal Edge Fitness Podcast with Garrett Williamson. Subscribe now and be a part of the show by calling 251-278-278. Edge or message us on Facebook and Instagram at Personal Edge Fitness or at Team PE on Twitter and visit us at PersonalEdgeFitness.com.